welcome to this new video for my channel, The Mental Traveler. I'm Caro Herrera and today I'm going to be reviewing a movie called The Patriot. It was released in the year 2000 and it starts Mel Gibson, Heath Ledger, Jason Isaacs, Tom Wilkinson, Jolie Richardson, Chris Cooper and many, many others. Before I begin though, let me just say that this will be a spoiler free video so you can sit back and enjoy. The movie is about Benjamin Martin, a peaceful widower farmer with several children who lives in a plantation in South Carolina and whose world is turned upside down when a sadistic British officer murders one of his sons right before his eyes during the American Revolution. This leads Benjamin, who used to be a very famous fighter during the French and Indian Wars, to lead the colonial militia and he also hunts down the man who killed his child. I give The Patriot a 4 out of 5 stars review because I really liked it and it has not lost its appeal throughout the years. It has a great cast, lovely customs and landscapes and a good script which helps make it a compelling and entertaining movie. I'm afraid I don't know how historically accurate it is but I read somewhere that Harrison Ford was offered the part of Benjamin Martin but turned it down in part because he said it reduced the American War for Independence to one single man's plight. And this got me thinking for a day or two, and while I can sort of see what Harrison meant, because as a child, when I watched the movie, I was more invested in the plight of the Martin family than on that of the 13 colonies. I do think that in a way the reason why I love historical fiction novels so much is because they allow me to learn about a period of history through the compelling story of one or two of its protagonists. So I think that it's nice to have a film that teaches you a bit about a point in history, and then if you care to, you can research more of it. With time I of course learned way more about the American Revolution. That doesn't mean I think that Benjamin Martin's story is a bad one. It was just that, that this fictional character supposedly inspired by other real life figures lived through this particular war told from his point of view in a way. I've always loved history and period dramas, so I have vivid memories of watching The Patriot when I was a kid and loving it. What has stuck with me over the years about it the most has been, of course, the story. And then the acting of Mel Gibson, Heath Ledger and Jason Isaacs. Why? Well, because Braveheart is like a great film that left a very impressionable memory in my young mind when I first saw it. So seeing Gibson in a sort of similar role was fantastic. And then I spent my teenage years watching Heath Ledger films. And I think this is just one of my favorite performances by him. As to Jason, Jason was like truly evil in this film. And he plays Lucius Malfoy in Harry Potter. And then Capitan Hook in Peter Pan, so I think he's like this really hot villain. Also, while Jolie Richardson didn't really have that much screen time, I love her because she is the sister of the late Natasha Richardson, but most of all because she's the daughter of Vanessa Redgrave, my favorite actress ever alongside Vivian Lee. So it always makes me glad to watch movies with her pretty talented daughters. Finally, I remember that when I was little, I got confused about Tom Wilkinson's character. I think I thought he was the king of England, but yeah, I think this is the first film I watched of him, or maybe Sense and Sensibility, but this one was the one that like really stuck with me the most regarding that actor. So yeah, all of these factors make The Patriot a very enjoyable film for me, but it's never been one of my favorite period dramas or anything like that. And I actually hadn't seen it in years until June 2021. When I was going through this phase of watching as much as I could about colonial America and the American Revolution, so of course I had to review The Patriot as well. Anyways, I think that this is all I have to say for The Patriot. Thank you so much for watching my review of it. I'm keeping my fingers crossed that you enjoyed it. Please let me know if you did or if you didn't, as well as what your own thoughts regarding the movie, its historical events, the characters, the acting, anything that's relevant because I would love to talk about it all with you. Also in the description box below you can find a link to the IMDb page for the movie. And well, I'm Gara Rara, the mental traveler, and I hope you have a wonderful day wherever you're in the world. I'll be seeing you soon, take care and goodbye!